President George A. Smith gave some excellent advice to those brethren who had been called to be home missionaries. He advised them to be generally brief in their remarks, and when they commenced to speak, to enter directly upon their subject and not waste time in making preliminary excuses, etc. The speaker alluded to some advice which the Prophet Joseph once gave him as he was about to start on a mission, to preach short sermons, make short prayers, and deliver his discourses with a prayerful heart. He had benefited greatly by following this advice. President Smith expressed his intense gratification that in the providences of God, President Young was enabled to attend General Conference. He, President Smith, had fully determined to adjourn conference from one Sunday to another until President Young could attend if it had to be prolonged until next October. President Smith closed his discourse by bearing testimony that the Latter-day Saints were engaged in the work of God and that the day would come when righteousness and peace would spread over all the world. President Smith stated that when the names of the authorities were presented to the conference to be sustained, the name of Jacob Gates was omitted until a matter of business with which he was connected should be inquired into and settled. Since then, Brother Gates has been communicated with, and there now remained no doubt that the matter in question would be amicably adjusted. The name of Brother Gates was then presented to the conference as one of the first seven presidents of the 70s. The vote to sustain him was unanimous.